Dave Knudsen, Gravity Capital. Today, this is slanted towards the investors. There's many investors that are talking to brokers, and some of these brokers are trying to tell you about loans that they would like to get your money to invest in. And I'm not saying that's a bad thing, but you gotta be very careful. The story today is a construction build on a property in Royce City, Texas, south, I think, of Dallas or so. Uh, this was a building that a physician and his partner, it seemed like fairly substantial people, wanted to build. It was going to be a farmer's market slash restaurant slash recreational uh, area, uh, art galleries, all kinds of stuff. The property had been probably half built. And this was a deal that was brought to us. Broker story. The broker brought us, which we deal with brokers all the day, all the time. We love them, but you got to be careful. So the original story came to us free and clear. The, the owners, borrowers, had invested $1 million. They had $500,000 in the bank, and they wanted $1 million to complete the property. I, uh, I did Before I went out there, I was a little suspicious about the deal and wanted to do a uh, walk through with the uh, with the owner and we did a FaceTime which was pretty neat the the property actually is pretty spectacular but the owner's side of the story was this property was not free and clear they still owed one hundred and seventy thousand dollars in addition to that the borrower still had three hundred thousand dollars in unpaid construction costs it's not that they were it's not that they were not going to get paid. They were just on the books for $300,000. They had invested about $700,000 in the property. And they had about $100,000 in the bank. Now, they still wanted $1 million for a loan, which was this, as you can see, was basically the only thing that was, that was the same. Brokers, $1 million, these guys. So the brokers painted this story Free and clear, a million dollars invested, 500000 in the bank. They were going to spend all that and get this, this completed. When we talked to the guys, they didn't actually have that much invested. So the deal we ended up turning down is just because, um, again, they were short, short here. They didn't have as much invested in the property as we wanted. They didn't have as much money in the bank. They wanted a million dollars, but we didn't want to put a million dollars behind all of this extra debt. Again, we like to stay at 50% loan to value of the value and or the cost, whichever is lower. So if they were gonna spend $2 million, we didn't wanna spend more than a million dollars, but then we'd wanna make sure that this thing was worth more than $2 million when it was done. I had some questions as to what it was worth. Remote area, uh, they were gonna run and operate it themselves. COVID was rampant and, um, just didn't make any sense. So the only thing I'm trying to point out to you at this point is that when you hear a story from a broker, again, this is for people who want to invest, do a whole bunch of due diligence, make sure it all checks out. You, we could have checked all this with bank records, how much they'd really spent. This all would have come out in the end, but did it real quickly with a phone call with a phone call to the owner that just opened up. He didn't have anything to hide. The brokers were just painting this story that they hope we could talk us into the loan. So keep that in mind when you're debating and contemplating investing on your own. And again, feel free, if you have a loan you're looking at, feel free to call us. We'll talk to you for free and just tell you what we think about it. It's no, no problem at all. Dave Knudsen, Gravity Capital. Thanks.